all right guys i really want to finish let me turn my mic down i really want to finish monster today in this recording session we got 10 episodes to go i really want to finish the series today um but the problem that i'm having is that i don't know if i want to release all 10 at once so that's what i'm thinking about um i'm still going to release them two by two but what i'm going to do over the next over the next five days you guys are going to have monster reactions right so today i'm using this time this recording session to get these 10 episodes done okay so that i can have them so for the next five days i well today that you're seeing this this day and then forward 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 you guys are going to get monster reactions until the series is over so that's what i'm going to do um the situation that's going on with the channel is still going on some people get get the, the notifications some people don't i don't know who does i don't know who don't but that is the issue i don't quite understand what's going on and i've been trying to figure out what's going on you know what i mean so that's the issue that i'm having i don't know how to actually you know even try to figure out or i've spoken to youtube they're telling me that everything is fine with my channel and and i know it's not fine and notifications is a big part of what they created you get what i'm saying and if people don't know that your videos are out there especially your subscribers it hurts the channel it's already hurting the channel not in the people that are subscribing to the channel but as in um the little money <laughs> you know what i'm saying that i'm making on the channel it's it i don't even know what to say to be honest i don't even know what to say but let's just keep trucking on as i said I'm, um i'm just gonna keep putting out the reactions hopefully in the future it gets fixed or is this what i'm going to have to deal with for the rest of my channel you know what i mean like is this what i'm gonna have to deal with i look at the statistics and the statistics is telling me that it's not sending out in the, no the, the the notifications that's what the your analytics for the channel is telling is telling me that my my channel is not sending out notifications but you're telling me everything is fine with my channel it's absolutely ridiculous but anyways we're gonna truck on as i've said before we're just going to dive in to some more monster reactions. I'm going to try to get all 10 done today. So what I'm going to do is I'm not going to be doing a review after every two episodes. So what is going to happen is you're just going to have to wait until the end of the series to see a full review of those 10 episodes. I might talk after the episodes, but I'm not going to switch to talk. You get what I'm trying to say? So I'm not going to switch screens to talk. I might just pause the at the end of the episode and speak about the two episodes, but I'm not going to record a review for it to the end, if you get what I'm saying. So it's going to be kind of a longer video in, I don't know, I don't know, whatever. Just telling you what's going to happen or are you just going to see it, whatever the situation is. But I'm trying to finish Monster today. But anyways. Thank you guys so much. Appreciate y'all. Let's jump into these reactions. Now we'll see you for the review. All right, let's do this. I'm not even putting up titles at the bottom. Let's just get monster finished. I 
And I was talking, you know, the last reaction I did, a lot of people was trying to, you know, tell me. All right, here we go. What happened? At, I mean, we don't have the full story of what happened at the Red Rose Mansion. Alright. I have theories. I have theories, so I gotta pause to talk. Um I'm guessing that this wine is a is a huge plot device. As in it represent it represents it's either they were drugged or they were poisoned. Cause I mean, from what Johan is saying here about, it, we still don't know the, the overall story of exactly, you know, what happened at the Red Rose Mansion, but I'm guessing that they're taking their time leading up to, to reveal the entire story, because we've got bits and pieces of what possibly could have happened there. Um, we know a bunch of people died there, and we're like, I don't know, it was a huge crime scene before the whole burning down of the, the, the um i think i think yeah so a whole bunch of stuff happened but we still don't know the entire story of what happened over there we know that at some point bonaparte was reading to kids and the, it, it was like a we learned that he was he was a spy right he was a spy or a former spy whatever the situation is um and he wrote kids books right there's a there's a lot that's being that's being revealed that i'm going to put together the pieces and see what it leads up to and i'm going to talk about all of it in my complete review of this series um i might have to watch over some episodes or maybe they maybe the you know not the entire series but certain episodes to kind of refresh my memory about certain things, but we're gonna get there. We're gonna get there. Let's go. You was trying to Johan don't work with nobody, bro.妹の身柄は我々が既に抑えた。私に何かあれば妹はお前の思い通りにはならない。いいか全ては私の計画通りに。僕は何？僕の中の怪物、僕の中じゃなかった。外側にいたんだ。何？ <笑> Right. How? <laughs> How can he be alive? You know what I mean? Like, you guys were telling me in the comment section because I was kind of confused because... He looks a lot. I'm wondering if Franz Bonaparte is Johan and Nina's dad. That's what I'm wondering. As because they they I mean the silhouette that I saw, I don't remember if it was episode 64 or 63, and I was like, isn't that Johan? The silhouette looks just like him how they've been showing him in the show. So that's why I thought it was him, and I was like, could it be that Johan and him is the same person? But no, they can't be. But I'm wondering, has he been looking for his dad? Is is that what this is all about? Is is he responsible 
for what happened to Johan and Nina? Is that what happened? Is Bonaparte their dad? Because we haven't really heard nothing about, you know, their father or anything. We've heard about their mother and something of the sort, you know, so I don't know. We'll see. Yo! なるほど。赤ん坊の言った通り、ただの小娘じゃないな。赤ん坊。赤ん坊の命令で私を捕らえに来たの。いや、赤ん坊は死んだよ。死ん。あんたを連れてくるように言ったのはペトルチャペックだ
お世話になりましたムスタファさん、うん、ムインさんスレイマンさんおいしい料理をありがとうドクターテンマンあなたまさかトルチャペックという男に関する資料が山ほど出てきますねああどうやらミラン・コラーシュが狙ったのはこのチャペックのようだな至急この男を探せ事情聴取を警部カイザーホテルで極右組織の幹部通称赤棒が殺されましたヨハンワナビアヘンのホテルを手入れしていたせいで。あれが悪魔の弟子。あの車の後。ヨハンいるのかいヨハン行ってたんだいヨハンニーナあなたは確かおエイヴァどこにいるのヨハンは今どこにいるのヨエイヴァプルダブルダブルダブルダブルダブルダブルダブルダブルダブルダブルダブルダブルダブチャペック is dead. That's why I said チャペック is probably dead right now. There's no way he's still alive. ヨハン、ヨハン don't leave no witnesses, bro. さあ、おいで、怖くないか。おい、待て、座れ。He's dead already. I think the wine is poison. Oh, see that, or he can't move. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. Why? I'm not going to be able to do that. Yo. すべては計画通りに誰の。Yeah, whose plan? ヨハンの。一
Die. It's got to be Johan Splando. I thought he was dead, but I guess he wants Nina to kill him. もし今出たらまだ続いてるのかな殺し合い私が引き合わせなければあのパーティー会場であなたとあんなことをしなければマルティンはマルティンは死なずに済んだのよ分かったちょっと待ってヨハンはどこ知らないよ僕も知りたいぐらいだ冷静になって 2週間このアパルトマンを見張ったわ彼は現れなかった他に彼の居場所はどこだから知らないって言ってるだろう本当によ耳が私は本気よ痛い痛い次は耳じゃ済まないわクリストフ<笑> ジーバーニヒ調べたわあんたのことはあんたの父親死んだエルネストは調べなくても知ってるけどねフランクフルトいえドイツ屈指のジーバーニヒ財閥のことならねまさかあんたがあの財閥の御曹司とはねペトルチ
戻ってきて教えてくれう,うん<笑>なぜだかわからないがその日511キンダーハイブの全員がおかしくなった子供たちだけでなく教官までもが殺し合いを始めた Is it the wine? あいつ逃げたんだ。僕たちを置いて逃げたんだよ。そんな。一人だけ助かろうとしてて。そうかな。嘘だと思うなら見てこいよ。きっと今頃あったかい食事にありついてるぞ。あいつ。あったかい食事
Let's get to the next episode, man. Yo, this is crazy, bro. Let's go, man. As I said, I have a feeling that Bonaparte is Nina and Johan's um, father. That's what I'm thinking. That's just a theory. You know what I'm saying? That's just, it keeps running through my mind that they're related somehow. Now this guy in the last episode, in the last episode, you know what I'm saying? Chapek is saying that um, he he's saying that basically the words he use is create. I know how you twins were created. Well, they obviously, you know what I'm saying? We saw the mom pregnant, right? But we also, um, there's something that happened. You know, at first, we, you know, we were thinking that, um, I still think that the brainwashing comes through Kinderheim. But, you know, I was kind of suspecting that something, something also went wrong with Nina, but she would probably kind of escape it all. Or the, the dual personalities, she has it too in some sort of way. But as I was saying that, it kind of seems like, the, the monster is the dominating part of Johan, but it's not for Nina. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's a part of her that's like that too, but her nicer side or more human side, if you will, is dominant in her, you know, or maybe she's just scared of becoming what Johan has become. I don't know what it is, but I have lots of theories, but I, but I need to grab something to eat really quick <laughs> okay I'm back just needed to grab nuts <laughs> peanuts and we'll continue as I said this is one of the most unique stories that I've ever watched overall whether it be TV shows or anime um, because it doesn't it doesn't really reveal anything to you like to be honest the bare minimum but let's get it oh they're just starting off with the intro okay どこ モラビア地方の小学校教師の一人娘として生まれ、ブロンドの髪、青い瞳の美しい女。ブルノ大学に進学、遺伝子工学を専攻、教授陣から将来を嘱望される再現だった。名前、名前など。I'm guessing this is the father and the mom, right? Is that Franz Bonaparte? Bonaparte. 
人種頭脳骨格運動能力選び抜かれた男と女の間に子供を作る数十例のカップルによって実験が行われ自分たちはその中の一例であると男はシナリオ通りに任務を遂行したが今やその通りに動く気はないと告げそして言った「So you fell in love with her?」ニオ Oh, she looks just like Nina, man. <laughs> Is this the <laughs> are they the scenario door in the Mokanai to sing in Stanga? その行動もすでにシナリオに組み込まれていた。So they were trying to, to create a specific They were trying to like create a specific type of people Kare They probably killed him. I don't think. I think that nigga's still alive. I think that that dude is friends, born a part day. You could have a good Kono Toko. Kanojo no Sungato or Sketchy Stink, Kono Toko. Kono Toko, Konoji can no Shubo Shadia. Or is this friends? What does she were your son? Anato Kishi, your son. What does she not shin them? Let me digest my nets, okay? All right, so what I'm thinking is the guy that painted the picture, I think that was France. So my theories are changing as I get new information, of course. I think, <laughs> I think that's France. And I think that's why Johan is looking for him because he thinks he's still alive. And this whole time, It's just Yohan try doing what he needs to do to get revenge. Is this is that's what it is? I don't know, but that's what I'm thinking right now. That Johan is looking for Franz. So Franz is not his father. Because they probably killed him. Um knowing this part of the story now, right? But I'm still holding on a little bit to my to my first theory of Franz being their their father. But this could be the guy because he um you know he's drawing her paints children's book he probably drew that too so that's why i'm putting two and two together here but let's let's keep going <laughs> so that's what i'm thinking 
彼女は通気口から脱出した。彼女が倒れていたのは門から数十メートルの路上、すでに破水が始まっていた。なんて美しい子たちなんだ。素晴らしい。あの子たちの名前を考えたの。余計なことは考えなくていい。考えたの。あの子たちの名前。考えなくていい。名前を。あの子たちに名前を。あの子たちに。いいんだ。名前などいらないんだ。That's got to be friends, right? Yeah. So that. Johan wa kare no ibasho o watashi ni kiita. Bonaparte wa ikite iru no. Watashi wa iru sanai. Anata wo keshite iru sanai. Watashi ga shindemu. Watashi no naka de dondon ookiku natte iku kono ko tachi ga.必ずあなたに復讐する。フランツボナパルタは生きているのね。ヨハンに聞けばいい。これ。ブレ。どんだいしゃな。この先に病院がある。あ、イデンケルム。ヨハンの居場所を教えれば、そこへ運ぶ。このままだとお前は出血多量で死ぬぞ。知らないもんは知らない早く言いなさいよ銅台じゃな銃で僕を撃つわ揚げ句にこんなに出血させて脅迫とはねヨハンはどこだ言いなさいよ。早く。知らないものは知らない。エヴァ。あそこに公衆電話がある。この車に出血多量の怪我人が乗っていると病院に電話してくれ。な、何言ってるの？もう少しでこいつはヨハンの。これ以上は命に関わる
また助けちゃった結局あんたはいつもこうだあんたには人は殺せない<笑><笑>先祖すぐに病院から救急車が駆けつけるわ早くこの場から逃げてでディンシーダーカミネーバーフォリオン賢三は言ったよあんたに伝言だこれ以上巻き込むことはできない君の人生を台無しにした本当にすまない幸せになってくれダットさん<笑>どうして泣くんだ Because you realize is how much she fucked up <laughs> like, that is not even a joke. Like, she messed up the best relationship she could have ever had. You don't see how she spiraled out of control ever since then? She blamed them for everything. She left them because he, you know, because he lost his job. なんとか食べそんなに慌てて食べると喉に詰まるぞよほどお腹が空いていたのねどこから来たんだい君たちはお名前は全然しゃべろうとしないんだねまあいいお腹がいっぱいになったらゆっくり話を聞こうか
私たち子供が欲しかったわねああ私たちで引き取ってバカなこと言うな<笑>いやきつい言い方をして悪かったとにかく警察に電話しようどうしたの僕見て見て綺麗なお花おじさんとおばさんにあげてくるねもういいんだえ言っただろいい計画があるってさあ赤いバラの屋敷から逃げ出して3匹のカエルの部屋にたどり着いた僕を君は迎えてくれただから今度は僕が君に言うよおかえりハイデルベルク二十歳の誕生日君を迎えに行ってから随分時間が過ぎてしまった迎えに来たあなたは殺しに来たのよあなたはフォルトナーさんをそしてリーベルトさんを今まで私たちに優しくしてくれた人たちみんなみんなあなたが殺したのよ生き返ってくれ Yeah, what the hell happened, man? Why is he just killing everybody? Is this like. Yeah. Oh. 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 僕を撃てよ殺して僕が助けてやる<笑>あの時みたいに撃つかいもうすべて終わりにするわ終わり終わりってなんだろう終わり終わり終わり終わり終わり終わり何度も何度も終わりの世界を見てきた終わりってなんだろう終わるわあなたが死んで私も死ぬ見てきた何を見てきたのあなた何を見てきたの話をあ
ただいま。Really? <laughs> All right. So we got the meetup. Okay, we got the meetup. Um, I guess we're gonna learn more about what actually happened um back then. Because from what Johan is saying that he left from where he was to go meet up back with Nina. So I'm wondering how they got separated because she was at the Three Frogs. He was at the Red Rose Mansion. So I'm wondering um, how did they get separated? Because it seems like they, they were being, you know what I'm saying? It seems like they were together at first um, from we see them run away from the Three Frogs. Wait a minute, man. Didn't they let... They're confusing me because didn't they light a fire or something at the three frogs and then ran away and then they killed those two people that gave them food? I don't know, bro. I don't know. I'm still a little confused on certain details that are being revealed. Um, or maybe it's just because I'm remembering stuff wrong, maybe. I don't know. But I'm pretty sure... At the beginning of this episode, didn't we see them run away from the three frogs? Wasn't that where they were? Right? I'm wondering if that's when he came back together and she said, welcome home. And then they, to escape from there. Let's get to the next episode. I will see you guys whenever you see this video. See you guys tomorrow for the next two Let's get it. I'll see you guys tomorrow. As I said, I'm not doing a long review after these episodes because I'm trying to do 10 episodes. It literally, it, is it 10 episodes or 11? I think it's 11 episodes I got to do in like this um, span of time that I have here. Um, so, yeah, I'll see you guys for the, tomorrow.